Hello, Leo. This is your uh, reading for September 2019. I'm asking what new energies are coming in for Leo for September 2019. And as you know, it will not resonate with all Leos. So this is for Leo. The energy is coming in for Leo. September 2019, full Celtic cross. Leo, September 2019, full Celtic cross. See, as you know, like I said, it will not resonate with all Leos. And I always look for a positive reading, but if we don't get one, we will work through it. We always do. Coming in energy for you. Feeling like someone's stabbed you in the back or someone's being sneaky around you. Maybe you're flying under the radar, but that's the incoming energy. And we will start, you know, putting this out here. And I do clarify or ask a second question with a different deck. So it may change up the story, so stick with me. Justice. Demanding justice. for all, Possibly from a sneaky situation. Sorry about this. It, it grabs a little. I got another... Um, Tablecloth come in the way to over cover to cover it over so it doesn't do this. But justice, demanding justice and getting justice when it's crossing it. Um, Nine of Pentacles, it may take a little bit away from your independence and some finances and we're trying to regain stability. Or maybe this is why you're doing it to regain stability. What crowns you or your goal is the Queen of Cups. You could take on this energy even though it is a water type energy. The Queen of Cups is uh, trying to regain your emotions, trying to um, not let things get to you, try to uh, still be kind even in this world, even with the Seven of Swords coming after you. But it also could be some of you are dealing with a water sign. Foundation, you're not real happy right now. It's not that it's not the worst card in the world in reverse. It just means you're not um, feeling as energetic and um, happy and go-getter as usual. In the past, ah, Knight of Cups, maybe your emotions were unchecked. Or maybe you're dealing with a water sign that is in reverse in the past, but your goal is to get it back on even keel. Again, it could be a water sign, even a possible little bit older than you or more mature in some ways. It could be also someone whose emotions aren't um, showing to you right now. Maybe you want to ask about these emotions and get them back to normal or where you want them to be. Your future lover situation, Leo. You got lover situation coming up in uh, um, September. But with that Seven of Swords, I'm feeling some of you aren't trusting it. Maybe you feel like they're not being honest with you in some way. But you got a lover situation coming up. That is a good card. You know, I find it to be positive. Some people don't. I do. Possible future outcome or advice from the universe has a little give and take is in order for this to succeed with the Six of Pentacles. Outside environment or what is coming towards you, the outside environment where you have no control. You just have control on you, but not the outside environment. The hermit in reverse. Maybe someone wants to come out of hermit mode or maybe they're stuck. I would have to clarify. Your hopes and fears. Maybe you're hoping to regain strength because it's, it's not there. Maybe you're afraid you'll lose strength. Maybe you're afraid um, some of your sunshine will be taken. But the strength card is in reverse, and these are the hopes and fears and manifestations. What I mean by that, you can turn this around. The outcome, you're going to stop working on something so hard. You're not going to let it stress you out, maybe. Maybe you feel like, I'm not going to put in a lot of effort that someone else may not be. So we got to find out what's going on because someone you feel is not doing you right. You feel like someone's doing something under the radar behind your back. And so maybe you want justice or maybe you're seeking the truth. So justice card in the upright, nine of pentacles in reverse is a subject in hand. Why are you there for Leo? Ace of pentacles. Yeah. You're not, you're not trusting in this Ace of Pentacles, this new energy. You're afraid it will not help you, you know, if you start this new thing. You're afraid it's not going to be real stable and secure for you. So the Justice in the Upright, Nine of Pentacles crossing it, Ace of Pentacles in reverse is a subject at hand. Why are you there? For Leo. And you don't know if you want to accept anything they have to offer with the Four of Cups, or maybe it's vice versa. Maybe they don't want to accept this from you, but you're not trusting in it. That's what I feel. Now, 
your goal, what crowns you as the Queen of Cups. This could be the one or energy. Maybe you're wanting them in the upright. Maybe you're wanting to trust them. Maybe you're wanting to offer an emotional commitment. Maybe you're wanting something more positive from this person. Or like I said, you yourself are trying to regain a more positive stance in life. So Queen of Cups in the upright. Why are you there for Leo? As what um, crowns them or the goal? Yeah, you want to gain a victory possibly with them or with your emotions. Queen of Cups, Six of Wands, both in the upright while you're there. Yeah, that may be you, Knight of Wands, taking it, you know, control, going forward with it. Getting your energy and your passions back with this, with the, with the Knight of Wands. As you know, that could be a fire energy, could be your energy. Now, as the foundation, you got the sun in reverse. The sun in reverse, it could be that you're just not feeling real happy as much as you could be. So the sun in reverse while you're there for Leo as the foundation. Yeah, you're trying to see things for how they are, or maybe because you see things now for how they are with the Two of Swords in reverse, where before you were blindfolded, maybe you're attempting to take the blindfold off and see things. Um, more clearly, but it's still having a little trouble there. Can I have another card for the Sun card and the Two of Swords in reverse? Yeah, and you're wanting a new stable offer if they're going to offer a message that is more um, sound and secure, not a bunch of, you know, fluff. You're wanting something more solid. And maybe someone sends you a message saying, you know, I want to talk to you about long-term stuff. But you're also unsure about it. You're not trusting it because the Seven Swords was beginning energy. Now in the past, this could have to do with the same energy, even though you got the Queen of uh, um, Cups as your goal. In the past, they were actually the King of Cups in reverse. Someone's emotions were not all there, you know, the way you wanted them to be. <clears throat> and they weren't showing you a whole lot of love. So the King of Cups in reverse while you're there in the past... For can I, mean, I almost said cancer. It could be that you're dealing with a cancer. For Leo. Why are you there for Leo? The star card. So you may have felt it was a hopeless situation. So the King of Cups, the star card, both in reverse. Why are you there? Yeah. And you may have wanted to try to take it. Uh, from taking a break with this person, but then you said, oh, it's just hopeless. You know, I like to sit there and talk to this person in some ways, but I don't, it may be just fruitless in the past. You were thinking that now in the near future, you got the lovers coming up. You could be, you know, um, involved with somebody or a couple of people with the lovers, but the lovers is in the upright and it's better than being stagnant. I like the lovers in the upright. Why are you there? Lovers in the upright. Near future for Leo. September. Queen of Wands. Yeah, you're... I think you're going to maybe start something with somebody. It could be the same water sign. It doesn't have to be. It could be something new. But you, like I said, you're not trusting it. And you're not exactly as open as you used to be with the Queen of Wands in reverse. And it could be that you're a little hard on them because of that. So it's talking about, more, I feel like it's more like don't allow the past energies of people messing you over. Mess up, you know, future lovers, okay? So the lovers in the upright in the near future and the queen of wands in reverse why are you there for leo queen of swords Oof. good like i said it could be more than two people you're just not trusting situations and i think it get a little haughty and a little um snappy if you're not careful with this lover situation and you can control this so it's really up to you and some of you like say is it's you the queen of wands could be you or you're dealing with another type of fire energy or someone short-tempered sharp words with the queen of swords in reverse so it, i'm thinking you're still dealing with a little bit in the past and future type people that you may be meeting up with so i'm thinking it's more than just one person that you're dealing with now the possible future outcome and advice from the universe is doing a little give and take they're saying um it could be that some of you may actually help somebody out that's on a down and out. That could be also the lovers and you're dealing with people in a reversal type situation. Some of you may be a little helpful to them. 
So Six of Pentacles in the upright while you're there for Leo as a possible future outcome and advice from the universe. Yeah, make a conscious choice of what you're wanting to do and make a good decision with the Two of Wands in the upright. Choose what is better for you. Even though it's give and take, make sure it's right for you also. So the Six of Pentacles and the Two of Wands, both in the upright, why are you there? Ace of Wands. Yeah, be careful what you offer, though. Don't offer everything you got this time to where, you know, you feel kind of like messed over again. Because I do see you not trusting a situation. Like I said, you got the four cups there where you may, ah, I don't know if I want this. And like I said, the incoming energy. And it does have to do with the lover's situation. So the outside environment, what's beyond your control is the hermit in reverse. The hermit in reverse, why are you there? For Leo, as the outside environment, or what is coming towards them? Why are you there? Strength in reverse. Someone may be coming towards you um, where before they were kind of like in a ghost mode in some way. Um, they may, may not have been feeling well. They may not have been emotionally feeling up to the situation. They may come towards you, but it's not like they're... They don't have all their strength, you know. They're coming out, out of the woodwork, but they're still feeling not the love or the energy that they should be. So the hermit in reverse, strength in reverse, why are you there? For Leo, as the outside environment, or what is coming towards them? Why are you there? Why are you there? The tower situation. Yeah, you may hear from or hear about, I'm thinking it's a lover because it's there, um, someone that was kind of quiet and you didn't hear from them in a while and you'll hear about something from them maybe they're sick maybe they lost their job maybe they're just in a bad way but you may be hearing about something and it could have been from a lover an old lover but i do also see something else coming in for you so i don't think i think you're going to deal with old lovers not necessarily um, get back with them in some way you're just going to be dealing with them and you got someone else there too maybe they're both past lovers i don't know but you're not trusting it so your hopes and fears, maybe you're hoping this person will get better because there's strength in reverse and maybe you're worried about the situation. The strength in reverse, why are you there for Leo? There's the hopes and fears and manifestations. Anxiety, yeah, you're wanting, some, you're wanting to come in anxiety because and, and, you're feeling like your strength is zapped or you're hoping this that someone else comes out of it. So the strength in reverse, nine of swords in the upright, why are you there? And the hopes and fears and manifestations for Leo, why are you there? And you're afraid that there just be no collaboration. And it's got you worried that if you give someone a chance or even friendship, even friendships, that they'll just, you know, that it just won't work out. In the end, you may not just work on it. You may just say, it's not that you're, you're going to put an end to anything. It's just you're not going to put all your effort out there with the Eight of Pentacles in reverse. You're like, I worked so hard on this before, and I don't know if I can put my energy back into that like it was before. So the Eight of Pentacles in reverse while you're there for Leo as the final outcome. Yeah, Queen of Cups in reverse. You don't know if you want to work on a situation as difficult it's too difficult. You may say, I'm not going to work so hard on it this time. And it has involved with the Queen of Cups, which again is a water sign. For some of you, you know, it depends on what you're doing. This person may be just not where you want them to be, or you don't, you don't think they will be there for you. So the Eight of Pentacles in reverse, Queen of Cups in reverse as the final outcome for Leo. Why are you there? Because you're afraid to just be too much fighting. You're not going to, you know... Even though the energy is telling you here, do some give and take, but make your decision wisely where you want to be in life. Because with the, there it is again, the Eight of eight of Pentacles. It's all about what you're wanting to work on. What, you, what are you willing to take on? I know you're not wanting to work with an emotional situation that would cause fighting, okay? So it says it's going to call for a little give and take and where you want to be, whether you want to offer a wand's energy. 
in the end, you may actually work on something, but it may not necessarily be for this, but it might be. You may later on decide, well, maybe I will work on it, maybe I won't, but they may even try to talk you into it. So it's up to you, Leo, whether you accept this, you know, struggle again. The universe does say do some give and take, but make your decisions wisely. Don't accept anything that's not good for you with the Seven of Cups because it can cause confusion. And the person may not be only um, dedicated to you, even even though you put all this work into it and then it'll just make you angry and mad and you're already trying to overcome heartbreak with the three of swords in reverse and you do not want to feel abandoned and neglected and left out and not having enough with the five of pentacles and you really do with like a new beginning in life and to jump into something that makes you know life exciting for you so it's really up to you how you deal with this I don't see you in the end wanting to work with this because you're afraid of arguments because an argument very well may occur. But the universe is saying, do some give and take, but not necessarily, it's saying, but don't necessarily give all your energy. Make wise decisions in which, which, which way you want to go in life, you know? You got two options here. You can grab a hold of both, but you're having a safety net where you're still holding on to something and going for something else, but you both want them at the same time. Where really you should go for what is better for you in the long run. So, and, you know, and work for stuff that is better for you. And because these options will come to you that are kind of confusing and not necessarily the, the best for you, that could put you into a heartbreaking situation if you're not careful. So take the advice from the universe. It's okay to give and take and talk to people, but make sure you go for what you're wanting. Don't just give your ace of wands to anyone. And go ahead, take that leap of faith and go into something new so you'll be happy again. And that is your reading, and I will give you another reading probably for mid-September that will actually maybe take off from this and will get some new energies or a totally new energy. So if you want to know what happens in um, mid-September, hit the like and subscribe and the bell so you'll be notified. And I'll talk to you later. Bye.